Miguel Banks, Miguel Banks Creates. Welcome to my channel. I want to thank all of my new and existing subscribers. I love you guys to pieces. I appreciate all your love and support. Guys, I'm on today to share my Hobby Lobby haul. Yes, I was enabled by all of the Hobby Lobby hauls that I've been seeing here on YouTube. And I went to Hobby Lobby. So let me show you what I was able to pick up. I picked up two of these um, Easter paper craft kits. They were $1.74. Let me move this one out the way so you can get a better look up at it. And this is the back of it. And I, I know you guys have seen it um, showcased on quite a few channels. But I went ahead and picked up two because I don't really have a lot of Easter craft things. So you get 10 12 by 12 papers, a sticker sheet, an alpha sticker sheet, and the die cut shapes. And aren't those, let me turn this light Turn that light on. Isn't the alpha die cuts gorgeous? But look at the paper. So I got that. That was $1.74 and I picked up two. I also picked up one of these kits, the farmhouse paper crafting kit. It too was $1.74, regularly $6.99. And you get 10 12 by 12 uh, scrapbook papers, a sticker sheet, alpha sticker sheet, and 48 die cuts. And this is what the die cuts look like. And that's the paper. And look at the sticker sheet. Isn't let me bring it a little closer. Isn't that sticker sheet pretty? So yes, this is farmhouse paper crafting kit. I was also able to pick up a bunch of diamond dots. Guys, they had the diamond dots for 74 cents, plus they had the diamond dot paintings. Uh, you know how you make the diamond dot paintings they had those on sale but i didn't pick up any of that so let me put this so you can really see um the colors that i picked up and i got 12 of them so i got oh that's upside down i got this color if you can see it it's like a and the camera isn't doing it justice it's like a peach color that's the number and these are two different can you see it this way two different pinks i picked up and i know the camera is coming off as an orange but that's the number 8036 and here's this number 8054 but guys this is like a darker pink and a lighter pink and i know the camera is picking up orange but it's really pink and this is a fuchsia or hot pink however you want to call it that's the number and this color know what you call this in like the rosy pink color family way that's the number here are the two greens i picked up now you can see the difference in the greens that's that number and that one and these are blues like a teal or aqua see those two different colors and that's the number for this one and the number for that one and I got a, like a daffodil yellow color because, you know, I want to craft for spring and stuff. And this is like, this is more of a peach color than this one, I would say. This, it's coming across yellow, but it's like a really, really light peach. And then this bright orange, and that's that number. So those were all, move this over here to the side. Those were all 74 cents. I also picked up some embossing powders. Now, guys, me and embossing are not the best of friends. I'm not a good embosser, but I'm going to keep trying and trying to see if I can get it. But at my store, they only had these three colors. So I got white, and it was $1.24. Silver, $1.24. And this is called Cottontail Dimensional Fluff. $1.24. So I'm going to keep trying to see if I can do some embossing. And I only picked up one ink pad. They had a lot of ink pads on sale, but I have so many ink pads already. It wasn't like I needed anything else, but I wanted to try this stays on pigment snowflake to see how it worked. And it was $2.24. So that, let me just move this here. I'm trying to make sure, oops, sorry for shaking the camera. I'm trying to keep down the glare. 
I picked up these uh, die cut stickers. They were $1.24. You get eight designs, three of each, and they were 24 pieces. And I liked it because I liked the wreath and the inspirational sayings. So this is what it looks like. That's what you get in the package. Got those. I also found these Prima Flowers, and these were the only ones they had. So I picked those up. They were $1.49. And I saw people with the little uh, zip baggies that you could put things in. My store didn't have any, but they did have these little pillow boxes, and they were $0.49, cents and you get 12 of them. So I went ahead and picked those up. Now, I did pick up some scissors. I got these for $1.74. I just, I love scissors, and you can never have enough scissors. And I picked up these little small ones for $1.49. Okay, move that over there. I picked up, I keep saying I picked up, but I know you know I picked it up. I was able to get these little stickers. I didn't buy, I just bought a couple of stickers because I have a lot of stickers in my stash. And I got one to go in the giveaway box. So these are the little butterflies, 62 cents. Aren't they cute? I thought they were really pretty, but they'll go in the giveaway. And I picked up two of these dimensional adhesive gems. You get 80 pieces. And it was 99 cents. And I got two of those. I like those. That's pretty. And the other sticker book I picked up was a Happy Planner called Gardening. You get 781 pieces, and it was $5.49. This is the back of it. But I'm just going to do a quick flip so you can kind of see what was in there. I just like the idea of the garden and the spring, like, summer theme of it. I'm not a planner. I don't, I don't, I'm not a planner girl. But I like to use um, the stickers in different projects that I create. So that was $5.49. Also over in that section was uh, some notebooks. And as any of you know, I am crazy about notebooks. I have more notebooks. I just can't get enough notebooks. So I picked these up. You get three packs. Um, they're 5.5 5 .5 by 7.95. And they have 80 pages each. It's three books. And they were just $2.74. And that's what you get on the back. You get sermon notes, notes, and a prayer journal. I thought those were really nice. Down the papers, uh, the aisle where the um, envelopes and things are, this was the only one they had left, folded cards and envelopes, 5 by 7 And I've seen a lot of people pick up, like, the um, teal in different colors. My store didn't have it, and to be honest with you, I didn't want to try to go all over town uh, looking for it. So these, what do, how many do we get in here? Let me see. It was $1.24. With five by seven, you get 12 cards and envelopes and it's black. Okay. And down the paper aisle, they had some paper pads on sale, but I don't really need paper. I have more paper than you can shake a stick at. But I did pick up this uh, four and a half by six and a half basics for a dollar forty nine, and those are the designs you get. And the paperweight, I will say, mm, let's see, it's it's a little thin, so it's like layering paper. And I also picked up this six by six pad of cardstock. It's called Brush Floral. You get twenty designs, three each. And that's what the designs look like. I can't flip through this because I haven't taken it loose because I'm not ready to use it yet. But this is what the designs you get. And that was the only paper I picked up. Now, my store did not have any of the Valentine. Um, it was all sold out. And I found this vintage Valentine um, paper pad laying just willy-nilly in the store. It wasn't even near the clearance section or anything. So it was $5.99 and I got it 90% off. This was the only one. And like I said, it wasn't, my store had no Valentine's. And this was, what, what section did I see this in? I think it, it was just laying around the store. I can't even remember where I told you. I was just walking down the aisle and saw it. So I picked it up. 
So guys, this is my Hobby Lobby haul. If you like the video, let me put this in frame. Give it a thumbs up. Hey, why don't you subscribe to the channel and hit the bell notification to be notified of new video uploads. Leave a comment below. I do respond to my comments. Um, I want you guys to continue to take care of one another. Tell me if you went to Hobby Lobby and what you were able to pick up and um, find because some people are picking up like rosette makers and things like that. My store didn't have that at all, at all. So again, I want you guys to continue to take care of one another, continue to be safe, and I will definitely see you in the next one. Bye.